Hello my beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. I hope you all are doing good and I'm pretty 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 well and this video is all about the blog, vlogmas series that I was going to start and uh, a tragedy happened with me. The tragedy was I recorded this video four days before and I recorded lots and lots of pre- uh, I have lots and lots of pre-recorded videos for now but the thing which happened with me was that I forgot to switch on my mic and the video went on muted. Then after after three days I actually realized that I can wrap I cannot do anything with that particular video. So here I am recording that video in the same thing that I was wearing on that day and I will be trying to do as close to as what I did last time. I have these two boxes from Nika. Like I ordered one box earlier for the things that I wanted and then the other box for the things that I thought that I'll make an entire video on. And one more thing, from today onwards, you'll be watching my video every day, every single day till Christmas or New Year, let's see, till what day. May it be a vlog, may it be a video. You will be getting a notification only if you have subscribed to my channel and if you have clicked on that bell icon, only then you'll be receiving that notification uh, that I'll be uploading every day at 12 p.m. noon. So. So keep on watching my video guys and I have a very very huge giveaway in the end of my last vlog. Like I'll be I'll be actually following my followers to see what are they up to and all of that stuff. I'll be actually replying to your comments, maybe my video or Instagram or anywhere. I have already swatched the wet and wild product. So without any further ado, let's jump into the video. So I have already swatched my Wet n Wild products in my video uh, on that same day when they were launched, like maybe a day after, because they were launched on 1st December, I guess, and I got the I got my things on 2nd December. So I've already swatched them in my stories. I know you cannot see it now because stories are just for 24 hours. But if you're not following me on Instagram, go check out my profile. That is Little World of Ami. I'll be writing it down here so that you can see that. So let's start with my things. I will be giving you guys an honest, honest review about each and everything. Um, my things are open now, uh, though I haven't uh, used them. But uh, I'll be giving you an honest review because this is not a paid video. I have bought everything myself. So the first, uh, I've already prepped and primed and moisturized my skin. Uh, not prime. I have uh, like I have done my cleansing, toning, moisturizing type of thing. And uh, if you see if you see this rosy cheeks, it's because of the cold that I'm facing here in Delhi. Today is eight degree, guys, eight degrees. So it's very, very, you know, it's okay for me to get red. So it's very cold here. I'm using Cover of All primer. I'm using this cover all primer from Wet n Wild. Already opened it, and uh, now I'm going to do it again. It's completely the uh, how it looks is completely like a cream, like any cream which you'll be applying. It's completely white, and the, and uh, if you ask me about the thickness or that point, so it's completely like a cream. Like you can feel that it's completely like a cream. Earlier, what hap what used to happen guys, I never used to give any importance to the primers. As till now also, touch wood, I do not have any open pores or I do not need any base to... So, I have got these two foundations from Wet n Wild. Uh, these are two different shades. One is bronze beige and one is nude ivory. Uh, I, there was a problem with selecting the shade online because I thought that one is too dark for me and one is too light for me. So hence they are, this is too dark for me and this is too light for me. So I'll be mixing these two. This one is having a light pink to undertone under, into it and this one is completely yellow undertone but this is too 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 dark for me. So I'll show you the final result. It was an unexpected turn Someone who gave my heart a third degree burn. You might have seen this place before, but for me being a debutant. 
time it's a little bit unsure so you must understand if i try to okay now after this i'll be using this wet and wild press powder is in the shade neutral beige i'm using the big large powder brush from sigma which is f30 guys uh, like when i made my earlier video which is now in dustbin so i actually actually didn't like this one it doesn't do anything there is no pick up on the brush i've tried different brush like see i'll do this completely i'm swirling my brush into it and nothing will happen just see to this how bad can a thing be i'm just looking at this thing koi farak nahi pad raha hai mere muh ko isse bilkul bhi then we have the wet and wild concealer it's in the shade light ivory here is the concealer from wet and wild so let's just quickly try this out i'm just choosing brush because i want to know that how is it blending out with a brush then i'll be taking this bronzer by wet and wild which is known as ticket to brazil so this is a very very light bronzer like when you wanted when i actually wanted for my very light thing and this is too light as well i mean like i haven't used any light bronzer till now so i don't actually know how light bronzers feel but yeah this is too light this was a bronzer bronzer not bad if you're looking for a light bronzer then it's good like it's it's actually working as a hula light bronzer from benefit okay so after this of course what we need is a brow pencil i like this pencil but the only bad thing about this one is that we have to sharpen it again and again and i don't like sharpening the brow pencil especially I'll be using my blush from Wet and Wild, which is in the shade Safety Seek, uh, which is in the shade Apricot in the middle. This is the color I can't blush. Like there is the ombre also, but I didn't want the ombre thing. I wanted this because I don't have this particular shade. So this is how the product should be picked. Like I like it. Okay, so after this blushy blushy thing, we'll be going to our eyeshadow palette, which is by Wet n Wild again, a nude nude awakening palette. Why am I saying Wet n Wild again? We are doing a Wet n Wild thing. Oh, so I'll be taking a small crease brush and I'll be doing my transition shade. These are the beautiful shades, like from light to dark. You can do smokies and light warms and everything. And there is the applicator brush. I'll show you the exact use of this applicator brush. Just wait for a moment. So I'll be taking this shade right here and dust it off. Too much of dust. But this is pigmented. Yo guys, we have won this. Thing. this is pigmented guys i'm too excited to show you what are the videos that are coming up and yes i'm very 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 excited like too much excited then to warm up the look i'll be using this burgundy shade right here on the same brush i'm making a warm crease Remember we are not taking the color into our eye area. You always have to deposit the color on your crease like always and then you have to blend it out. Then again to warm up the look even more because I like little warm eyes. So I'll be taking this gray, not the black. And I'll be putting it on my outer corner of my eye. Like I'm just putting it there and then blending it out inwards with small strokes i'll show you with a bigger brush which would be easy with taking this and dusting 
it all. If I try to get the lay of the land, it's a lot to take in. Can't seem to read your face, don't know where to begin. Now uh, we're left with this white thing inside, so I'll be adding some white thing here, like in my inner corners. In my earlier video, the glitter eyeshadow which I used was this. It's in the shade Bleached, but in today's video, as Christmas is around the corner, I thought of doing it all red. So I have this red glitter eyeshadow, which guys you cannot see because of that taping. And uh, I'll be doing this and you can see that then. Here is this glitter eyeshadow. I've already swatched it on Instagram. You guys need to follow me there to check out my latest updates. This is absolutely, absolutely beautiful. So we are now going to use that applicator brush because we can actually not pick any glitter or pressed glitter with our brushes. So I'm going to swipe my brush here and I've get, got this pigment here on my applicator. And uh, voila! Guys, it's too patchy, but uh, still I'm trying to make it better, make it work. The last one which I tried was bleached and it was pretty good. I'll show you that too. Uh, it looks white, but the pigment which it throws is a bit of golden. I'll show you a closer look of what my eyes look obviously but I personally feel that this one is better the red one the red one is actually petty so do not use the red one if you are a beginner we have the fine liner from wet and wild which is a pen liner which is this one it's quite small in size like very very small and I don't like small liners again so let's see how it works This is an okay sort of liner like there's nothing like that oh my god I've I've used this liner for the first time or something like that no then comes the time for the mascara it is the lash renegade wet and wild mascara I have heard lots of bloggers talking about this so let's 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 do this the packaging looks quite royal so if you're looking for a beautiful mascara which looks beautiful you can have this in your vanity first point and second point i'll let you know that if you can have it for its own self this is a good mascara you can actually go ahead and try this out buy this one all these products are below 1000 only, I guess, I guess, yes. So you can go ahead and buy all of this stuff if you like all of this stuff. Then I have the highlighter from Wet n Wild. Uh, then I have the highlighter uh, Mega Glow, which is in the shade Precious Pearls. Taking this on my fan brush from Sigma again. It's a little bit unsure So you must understand This is again a good highlighter like you can wear it on a daily basis Like if you if you like highlighter if you are a highlighting type of a person 
then you can wear it on a daily basis. I have got here with me the Wet n Wild Makeup Fixer Spray. Uh, this one. This is the cutest bottle ever. So, yes, going with this. And I actually, actually wanted a good fragrance. So, this is a good fragrance. Go ahead and buy this. I really, really, really love this. I've already got this one before earlier when Wet n Wild was not even launched in India. So, this is a very, very, very good thing. So, go ahead and buy this one, guys. I love this. And then again, to make sure that my highlighter goes well, I'm again going to take this. If you guys want a blinding highlighter, always put your highlighter before the spray and after the spray and you'll have a very, very blinding glow. Have a look. I am actually looking like a highlighting doll. So, let's jump into the lipstick. The last thing which I have here with me is this lipstick, Wet n Wild Catsuit Lipstick. I already have used the other shade of it, but that's not available on Nykaa, so hence I'm not putting that one here. It's in the shade Missy and Fierce, which I am. I complete my look if you like this look then don't forget to give it a thumbs up like this video and click the subscribe button down below and comment if you like from today onwards you'll be watching every video of mine at 12 p.m. every day don't forget to check that out and click that bell icon for the notifications I'll be revealing my giveaways winners name tonight on Instagram bye